Okay, so how many of y'all ever heard the 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 story that Michael Jordan invested in prisons, right? It was mm-hmm. a different it was a different one, right? Not yeah, actually actual... this guy. This guy, mm-hmm. this guy is named Michael Jordan. This white guy right here is named Michael Jordan. <laughs> so somebody went on went went like um that this happened back in the 90s before the internet in, in the two early 2000s, not before the internet, before social media. Before social media, it was hard to dispute lies. So they were like, oh, somebody looked in some, some prison log and they found that this guy named Michael Jordan was investing in private prisons. Which is, of course, if you're black, that's wrong because I guess black people are dominant people in prison. If you invest in that, you're cool. We're in 2023 and black people still think that it was actually this Michael Jordan just because some guy on the list of investors for a prison was named Michael Jordan. 20 years later, they're still saying that. Even though it's this guy whose name is Michael Jordan, he's the guy who invested in prisons, who was smart. And I and let me tell you niggas something right now. Let me tell you fucking apes something right now because y'all annoying me, man. I would drop every dime I had into a prison right now because I know you niggas ain't gonna stop going and I know y'all go y'all kids gonna go and their kids gonna go and it's gonna be a lucrative investment and anybody else if you got want to get an investment fuck gold invest in prisons these fucking niggas is never gonna stop going there ox prison's gonna have 30,000 sun men and 545 square feet yeah exactly (laughs) exactly it's just it's just it's just we're becoming exhausted. I feel the same way about some people as fishermen feel about glider women. We're becoming exhausted, man. We're wearing people out, man. It's just, it's too much, man. It's too fucking much. All right.